This crowd was vocal, the language on the signs was strong, and Coatesville residents took up almost every inch of this auditorium Tuesday night. I respectfully request the resignation of the entire school board. The school board and its legal counsel are under fire, and the boos and cheers for the resignations proved that in the wake of a racist texting scandal involving Superintendent Richard Como and Athletic Director Jim Donato. You've known about the texting for over a month, and never once did you say a word. And you do a nice song and a dance for us, but it still don't ease the pain of the people. We're looking for some basically closure. Board President Neil Campbell spent almost 30 minutes giving a timeline of events of when the board knew what last month and acted. He also confirmed what's been rumored in this community for weeks. There's an ongoing criminal investigation involving kickbacks for high school football camps unrelated to the district. And indeed, we believe we were acting responsibly by, main, by main, maintaining our silence during the course of this investigation. People here, angry Superintendent Como was allowed to retire instead of fired, were told this board had no control over the pension he's able to collect, and it can only be taken away if convicted of a crime. Campbell said the board wanted the top administrators out immediately, but also wanted to avoid possible lawsuits for not following the termination process properly. The damage done to our community by these men cannot be calculated or measured. Like all of you, we are thoroughly disgusted and shocked by what they did. 